And we are going to be checking out Cyberpunk now that it's had a um, a big patch. In fact, how many pages of patch notes were there, Chris? All of them. Um, <laughs> there were a lot. Uh, someone, the earliest meme I saw of uh, the patch notes, someone actually printed it into a uh, Star Trek intro or Star Wars intro oh, uh, no. generator. <laughs> and man, that thing lasted about the Star Wars. Like, seriously. Uh, so I'm already noticing a lot of changes off the bat. Um, off the butt? Off the bat. Um, one of my favorite things that I've noticed a subtle little just spice of life kind of deal um when you go into your inventory and you check your gear it tells you it has the little up or down arrow which it didn't have before oh. you actually had to hover over it and it's just you know just nice to have because mm -hmm. uh, it does that also when you're doing when you're in the shops um and that when you're picking awesome. up gear off the yeah so because one of the dumbest things is picking up gear and being like is this worth <laughs> is this picking better? up or not is yeah not? yeah, so yeah much can i it? just dismantle this shit or what you yeah because there was like a skyrim level amount of shit um oh yeah it's being shoveled into your inventory or I should say like a fallout level um i don't know where i just went i didn't mean to click that <laughs> but yeah so it it started out and don't get me wrong, I had fun playing it, given uh, mm -hmm. I was playing it on an earlier rig. And holy crap, I'm amazed it could even run Cyberpunk. Uh, but yeah, it was uh, it was okay for what it was. Now, um, it's even a lot better. Like the, It just feels smoother, and this is after rebuilding my rig, playing it again. Um, like, you know, it just feels a lot smoother. And also... Oh, no, nope, they didn't fix that. <laughs> oh, so they were supposed to fix what was uh, that? getting run over. So one of the patch notes was basically like smarter AI drivers that won't just up and run you over all the freaking time. Well, you did. Just, that was a lie. You sort of like you straight up ran out in front of that car and took it in the shin, man. Oh, yeah. No, I definitely <laughs> that was the intent. Um, I am trying to see now the AI on the cops has been changed as well. So that guy gave me the perfect opportunity to commit a crime. Um, yeah, you pretty much blatantly shot him right between the eyes. Oh, yeah, definitely. Random civvy violence is always fun. Um, I don't know why I'm going this way. I really, I've tried to do... So the AI on the uh, enemies has gotten a little better in the sense that uh, I got marked like three times. <laughs> they surrounded me. It was actually pretty kind of cool. Hmm. Um, and the cops didn't bug me like, OK, that was one of the problems we had with original cyberpunk was the cops were just like these relentless auto slaughter. Like, yeah, like you couldn't do they anything. went They went Judge Dredd on you in a heartbeat and <laughs> they, they really just swarmed you. you and sneeze yeah, and look around like shit. Right. So I, after I shot that guy just now, uh, you know, the the stars alerted and everything like that. But, oh, what? I guess I'm shooting this guy. <laughs> this is a weird pistol build that I enjoy. It helps that I found a freaking amazing pistol. You just shot him in the dick, like, until it drops. That was kind of ruthless. So, yeah, and aiming is not as easy, but I'm okay with that because it was almost too easy. Mm -hmm. It was, yeah. Um, yeah, no, overall, I'm actually pretty happy about it. Um, gameplay is a little bit better. It's not so um, meh. <clears throat> well, show, uh, show us driving, because that was... <clears throat> oh, that's right. That was a big part of that update. Yeah, and have you tried it since they have updated it? Wow, um, that was almost Very a little. <laughs> oh, no, I'm getting my car. I don't know which car I have it on right now. Hopefully it's the motorcycle. Yeah, but it, the motorcycle it, was always decent. So this is the one they gave to it from Akira. They, like, tried to model it. Oh, it kind of does look like the Akira one. Oh, how do I do... <laughs> oh, no, no, no. That's why I was like, I need to grab a truck. <laughs> yeah. Let me... Because I forgot how to get out of first person view oh, on this. Oh, uh, it's tab, right? Is it tab? No. Couldn't be tapped. Well, fuck it. We'll go in the truck. Where's Cedric? I'm here. I'm watching. Oh. 
we we trade off. So I was <laughs> the MO news. I'll let him do the uh, the cyberpunk stuff, and I'm just watching. Okay, so I'm going the wrong way down this street. So I don't know if it's this truck. It's a little sluggish. I'm pretty sure it's just a truck. And that guy just ran straight out in front of me. So we still have pretty stupid civilians there. We'll let you get a little How do I handle on it. I, it looks radio. beautiful, though. Like, <laughs> Much better. Yeah, also less licensing issues. Right. I forgot all about that. Yeah, it looks a lot more, I hate to say GTA-ish, but that that's a good thing. Well, I yeah. Mean that, like, um, before, driving was just such a, what the fuck? Like, it was the worst driving. Um, Oops, sorry, that was on me. <laughs> Well, I mean, the driving is only as good as the driver, I suppose. <laughs> no, I was just thinking back to our Red Dead Redemption video. I was like, was it really Red Dead's fault that we... <laughs> well, it that was a dead end. Um, but you know what? I mean, overall, it's actually kind of not horrible. Let me grab a different car. You know, no, let me head back to the motorcycle now that I know how to change it. Hey, how you doing? Nope, nope, me cold shoulder, bitch. <laughs> We can edit that. I'm, out no, I'm not that. editing anything. <laughs> so, <laughs> be on your best. <laughs> oh no. Okay, so they didn't really fix that. It, it took a second to load in uh, with my person, made them look bald. But at least they weren't T posing. True, true. The T posing, I forgot all about the T posing. <laughs> the T posing. <laughs> Would really hurt the immersion factor. Okay, so this definitely handles a lot better than I remember. Because I remember trying to pull those little 180s, and it just was not okay. <laughs> I just remember trying to turn. Like, I wasn't trying to be fancy. I was just trying to avoid destroying myself on the way to missions. Right. It was always a nice thing when you found the, the fast travel points. Um, oh, cause yeah. then you were like, oh yeah, I don't have to drive. Sweet. Um, oh, yeah. speaking of which, do we have the patch notes up at all? Uh, just to see if the things they say are true. Uh, we do not, <clears throat> but I can't actually get out of my screen cause oh. <laughs> I'm re recording it full screen right now. Oh, okay. That's okay. Um, oh, let me see if I can get it over all of them. Yeah, overall, it's definitely not bad. Um, one thing I do need to try, and this is just going to get me in a whole bunch of trouble. <laughs> Nick has the worst excuse ever for tonight. <laughs> what did he say? And it's going in the video. Uh, I'm helping organize and appraise magic cards. Okay. Is that like the nerd way of saying I'm washing my hair? <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> 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 I was to oh. oh shit. So they they do still respond pretty heavily if you knuckle up and kill like six oh, yeah. with your bare hands. Yeah, I'm pretty sure I killed a homeless person with my bare hands, and that was what I was testing, was they did some uh, things with that Gorilla Grip mod. Um, gorilla Grip? So, uh, yeah, it's the one that you have on the arms where you can actually rip open doors and stuff like that instead of needing a key. Oh, I was thinking, like, an actual mod for the game. I was like, they're allowing mods already? Oh, no, no. Oh, okay. Okay, so I'm not running into any other cops. I'm sure they're chasing me somewhere. Is it but just me or are there less people on the streets, though? It does look like that. Um, are you all committing a crime? Or are you just... Oh, hi. Cedric, you played it, right? Oh, Jesus. I <laughs> played it, yeah. Oh, she was ugly as fuck. He's wearing almost the same shorts. <laughs> I love this game. <laughs> oh, 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 no, don't. No, I was just going to no. say, we were... Hi. Um, 
Like, does it is it just us, or does it seem like there were less people on the streets though after the patch? Yeah, so that that was honestly my con- my complaint with the entire game. So I understand it's an urban like it's an urban setting. It's going to be tighter, smaller, so they can fit more things in it. I understand that scale being changed a bit, but and maybe this is not fair to do. But in my opinion, it is because it's a similar game. I think about GTA's urban setting and its downtown setting, and it feels very much alive. Um, yeah. I don't get the same feeling from this game. It feels, it almost feels like the scaling of everything is off. So like when Chris was driving, it almost, it feels like it's a little micro, like uh, micro trucks, Tonka toy (laughs) road with a Tonka toy car and like not much going on like this. Like this is like, this is downtown. I see three or four cars on the road. Like what? Come on. What time yeah, it is just, it, too? Like, it's weird, like, in this. Um... We're in the dead of the day. Like, <laughs> yeah, that looks like it's good as morning with night. It's a ghost town, it feels like. And that was my big con- that was my big complaint with the game in the beginning, is that, you know, as an RPG, I should be losing myself in it. I'm not. Right. And I'm noticing, like, this just doesn't feel... Lived in. It doesn't feel immersive. It feels very on rails, almost. This game... It doesn't feel. I don't get that overwhelmed feeling that you get from true open world games when you first get into them. You know, okay, I'm gonna like kind of add to exactly what you're saying. Is yeah. it feels very Truman Show. Yeah, it do, yeah, that's actually a perfect fucking way to <laughs> to, to, to explain it. It yeah. feels like there's always that man behind the glass window, like just kind of watching. Like, oh, oh, don't do that. <laughs> nope. Right. Ah, no, 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 no. <laughs> you're gonna break it. Actually, as a matter of fact, let's uh there is a place I need to see what they did with if anything. Oh, and you're there like, was you're this... in city center too, aren't you? Oh yeah. Um I think where is it? Where is it? This do you is have it, the, right? Do you have the size of the crowds turned down, like in your options? Not that I know of. Maybe I did do that. Um because I remember, I never, it, okay, I, I totally understand the Truman Show aspect of it, and <clears throat> and I, yeah, I high agree. density. Wow. Okay, I was going to say, I agree largely with everything you guys were saying. It's just it never felt as dead as it does right now. It feels like they removed people, um, citizens I, from the game. We're going ha- to have some fun just for the hell of it. Um, like, See, they do the bald fun. thing. And that might just be my rig, but that's so weird that it loads in so slow. Because my character isn't bald. She actually does have hair. Hey, I don't, you know. Well, no, I mean, I'm, I'm just shame your using that to... Oh, <laughs> <Instead> <laughs> of, believe you me. Not make a bald gallywag, go ahead. <laughs> <laughs> you told now, us about um, the hyena plans back in the Destiny 2 video. I'm all right. Like, not gonna suddenly get weird on you now. Oh, <laughs> See, all right, there. Yeah, <coughs> I should have just fast traveled. No, but you no, know what? It's actually, not. right? Yeah, no. This is actually kind of cool because the fact that it's smooth. Now, again, I have some differences between my old rig, my new rig, and now because after the patch, and it's actually running a even a. Is a dick ton an actual unit of measurement? Because that's what I want to say. <laughs> it's running like insanely smooth compared to how it used to. Wow, yeah, you probably would not have been able to stop at all before. No. Oh, yeah, I would have just rammed through all that shit that just happened but there. Like, where the fuck are all the hobos, man? Like, that was exactly. a Exactly. Like, camp. I should have run. Yeah, I should have run over one or two people there. At least. I'm saying. Like,. It really and does I mean, I feel like they've really seen any cars. No. Um, that's not a good thing. No. And I'm I'm kind of wondering if maybe that isn't like a a more common complaint. I, I haven't really talked to anybody else since the you know the game has been patched. I haven't right. even really watched any videos on it. Unfortunately, I probably should have, but um, I definitely want to know that. If other people have noticed the exact same thing. 
See, even this, I feel like this dirty ass uh, empty alleyway, it's missing people. like dogs. Not only people, but yeah, like Tumbling. trash cans and yeah. Assets. Like someone has been yeah. cleaning. Oh, there were dead people back there. What the fuck? Yeah, that was, <laughs> I was going to say that. that was... What are the things above you, by the way? Do you see them? Uh, those are like shipping container uh, drones. Okay. Yeah, that's, that's kind of what I was thinking. That's weird. That's Amazon. I was just going to say, that's like, that's, uh, that reminds me of the Amazon buildings outside of uh, Louisville. Just a little bit of <laughs> God damn. <laughs> <laughs> oh, man. It's going to be like that, I'm sure, someday. Holy shit. Now, driving definitely feels a lot more responsive, though. Yeah, but the world's um, about as lively as the Surge 1. Truth. Um, I don't know if any of you have played that. Or if it was yeah, just me and Nick. We're not going to talk about it. Okay, you have played uh, it. <laughs> well, if you like Dark Souls games and you haven't tried the Surge, then I feel badly for you. Because you should know what a really badly done Souls game looks like. And play like. I would definitely like a farther out mini map, and I'm not sure if that's just one of my settings or not. No, but that was yeah. always an issue I had with this game. Always felt way too pulled in. Another thing that drove me nuts was like in the character creator. Oh, here's the fun part, by the way. Uh, go ahead. Keep talking. No, you're all right. I was just going to say what the way they like they tried to make it so that people couldn't be perverts, you know, which right. fine. I get that. It, luck. it was like to the point that it. What? <laughs> <laughs> so this is like the border. Um, <laughs> yeah, I guess so. <laughs> yeah. So vehicles uh, will get stopped there automatically. Um, I'm surprised they didn't start shooting at me. When is it the border to? Uh, the city. Um, I mean, I'm not seeing any guards, though. This place was swarming with guards, mechanical and human. And now I'm wondering if they just walled it. So, <laughs> hold on. You're at the edge of the map? Is that what you're saying? So, let me show you where I am on the map. It is way down in the southwest. Oh, wow. Um, and there's this thing that before, one, it didn't stop you there. Um, I have tried so much to try to uh, get past this, and they will murk you all the time. I'm like, I'm waiting to see when I get shot, because it's not a question of, am I going to get shot? It is a question of, yeah, you're going to get shot. That thing you had looks like a bolt gun, and then the other one looks like a super soaker, so... Um... Suicide. Holy shit, it's been a while since I've played it, I guess. I forgot all about quick hacks. There's the guards, at least. So please note, I did not do a lot of uh, damage to that. No, not really. Not really. It's it's definitely going to kill you, man. It's going to kill the shit out of you. Oh, wait. I just, like, half damaged. But this is a bad fucking idea. Yes. But do it anyway. Let's see. Let's see if I can... Oh, no. I don't have enough. Ah, fuck it. You were yeah, definitely is, getting oh, torn no. up. <laughs> oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Let's see how quick they came wow. to respond and how little damage I'm doing to them. <laughs> oh, shit. Oh, yeah. You're going to die before that grenade blows up. Oh, yeah. Or not. I didn't even hear it go off. Go, go, go. Oh, that's new. What, 
with the um... yeah the arc. Yeah, the fact that I'm doing like zero damage to that guy really sucks. <laughs> I'm glad that part came to real clear in the video. Oh yeah. Oh damn. Yeah, you're getting torn up. Uh, not really. I mean, my health is still at max. Oh okay. Jesus. It's just like an annoying stuttering then. Somebody neutered the border, uh, border guard. Oh. Finally killed one of them. Are they doing any damage to you? What? I'm like, like who gave really wondering. Bullets? So that's really kind of strange. Because, oh, it's my regen is really high, apparently. Yes. You Wolverine? Oh, there it goes. Now you're dying. There we go. Oh. <laughs> yeah. Oh, because like eight more of them showed up. Yep. Fuck. <laughs> oh, I probably laughed really way too loud into that mic. Oh, well. Oh, shit. Oh, yeah, I'm toast. <laughs> Damn. Oh, yeah, that was that was the... Uh... Yeah, they they don't they don't end there. Well, I, that's a good idea of uh, of what cyberpunk looks like. But I definitely do want to hear more um, about what it might potentially you know look like oh. after the patch. Because from what I oh. sorry about that. Welcome back. Yeah, you were trying to disconnect from the stream, weren't you? <laughs> yeah, I totally was, man. Um, <laughs> what I was going to say is that uh, I would like to hear more about like what it's like now that you know it's been patched. But um, Oh, yeah, definitely. Because, just, I mean, looking at it. It, it definitely was a game that was worth looking at. Um, I don't regret buying it. I know a lot of people did, especially with all the crazy shit happening with it. But, I mean, CD Projekt Red, love them or hate them, they're still trying to make up for it. True. And I feel like if we had just waited until this month this would have been the game that came out you know um but i digress you know who knows if it would have um, been better or not yeah right yeah exactly so so yeah it's it's one of those things um you know if you're looking at buying a game now um and it, it, you're interested in cyberpunk definitely go for it um cd oh, project sure. red is never meant to do us any harm even though you know it's kind of yeah, maybe Catering not collectively, but some right. of the people up top have no real defense anymore. Um, oh no, I screw those guys. I'm talking like the developers, the yeah. the, the the people that programmed it, and you know exactly. the people that actually saw it as a vision instead of a profit margin. Yeah. You know? The people who worked on it, I'm sure, um, a lot of them, you know, really poured their heart into it, and and they oh, deserve yeah. better than they got. But we'll we'll see where it goes. I, I think I'll play it a little bit myself. Maybe we'll talk about it more on Wednesday. But um sure. thank you, uh thank you both for coming and thank you everybody for hanging out with us tonight. Um won't you be my neighbor? Wow. Not don't I?